What's up you guys, today we're going to make a progress bar. So first thing first, we need to make a new fusion composition. Make it here and place it into your timeline. Okay, make it as long as you wish, then go to the fusion. So first thing, let's add a background node. And let me just make this screen into a single view, okay? Now add a rectangle mask to our background node, okay? Go over here where it says where it says width and make it one. It's important, make it one, remember. Because before I made this video, I jumped into Fusion to practice and I made this mistake. You see, I didn't set my width to be one. And so my progress bar was already over, but the numbers, but the percentage didn't reach 100. So yeah, this is the importance of making width one. Now let's bring this a little bit down here. Okay, let's make center to be, yeah, good. This doesn't really matter, but make sure center is at least 0 0.5. Okay, let's bring our height a little bit. Let's make it down there. It doesn't really matter, but just put it down there for now. Okay, now let's say I want it to be placed down there. So next thing is to make copy of those two nodes on your keyboard press ctrl and c okay then add a, a merge node here and a merge node there paste our copied nodes and place it there okay now let's add a transform node down here now okay we have our transform a little smaller and change the color I found my gradient color. It doesn't really need to be green color. You can use a solid color. It doesn't really matter. Okay, well, let's go back to our transform node. Make it again a little bit smaller. Go here to our rectangle. Uncheck this solid and pump those border width a little bit. Let's make, okay, now we can make white here a little bit lower then but on those it's important to be one now let me just place it to be somewhere around here in these borders all right people so i took my time and i made this something like this let me just change color from this to be something orangish like this from this background i said make it like this cool and we have our rectangle masks of the background here and remember this is with one now copy and click on the background one underscore one and paste it again okay now we have this one middle node here and go here to the paint mode and select subtract right now go here where it says center and select expression on this first number ignore the second one press space plus space time slash comp point render and and then press enter Okay, let's see how this looks in our edit page. Okay, you get the point. Now, <laughs> it's, yeah, you see, it works. Now, if you people maybe want to have a percentage of how much this progress bar is completed, we can now add it to but you will need to paste it because I will leave it in the in the description below this formula. So just follow me. Okay, now we're back in the fusion and we need to add a merge node here. Then we need to add a text node there and here. Right click and add expression. Delete this and paste this 
Okay, now after we paste it, place it there in the middle. Let's make color. Okay, now let's make a color to be something different than white and black. Then go back here on our edit page and let's see. Cool, we have it. Now, if you want to make this a little bit smaller, bigger or whatever, just select this transform option here in our edit page and lower it. And there you have it. You can place wherever you now want it. If you want to place it there, there, and it will work just fine. Yeah, that was it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.